The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, third canto, twenty fifth chapter, text number seventeen, given by His Divine Grace A. C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on November seventeenth, nineteen seventy four, in Bombay, India. Tada Purushatmanam Kivalam Pratite Param Nirantaram Sayana Jyoti Animanam Akhanditam This is self realization. <coughs> self realization means to see one's proper identity. Uh, at the present moment we are not finding out our proper identity. We are saying to the body, I see you, your body, and you see me, my body. We have no uh, vision of the real person which is, who is occupying this body. That is the first lesson we get from Bhagavad Gita. Dehi nasmin jatha dehi. Dehi, this body is called deha. And the owner of the body is called dehi. Dehi nasmin jatha dehi. Kaumara jovanam jara. Tatha dehantara prapi. So, <coughs> When we can see that we are not this body, I am not this body, that is beginning of self-realization. That is called Brahma-bhūta stage. Ahaṁ brahmasmi. I am not this material body. Ahaṁ brahmasmi. This is self-realization. So what is the identification? of the jiva, of the soul, very minute. Uh, animanam, very, very minute, infinitesimal. Uh, God is infinite and we are infinitesimal, very small particle. That's like the sun. Sun is very big, but the sun sign it is a combination of very minute, bright articles, atoms. Everyone knows. Uh, it is a combination of, uh, I mean to say, dazzling, bright. Similarly, we are also a small, bright uh, particle. Uh, <coughs> uh, the same quality, Sayanga Jyoti. Just like God or Brahma is Jyoti, we are also Jyoti. But Brahma is all-pervading, infinite. We are Unimanam. The Mayavadi theory is that at the present moment I am the same. Their theory is ghatakas patakas. Just like in a ghat or in a pot, there is within the pot there is sky, and outside the pot there is sky. So the separation is due to the wall of the pot. When the wall is broken, then the inside sky and the outside sky become one. <coughs> This is Mahavad theory. <coughs> Therefore, here it is said, akhanditam. Akhanditam means not that the uh, sky within the pot is fragmented from the whole sky. That cannot be. Uh, in the Bhagavad Gita also it is said, achidayam. Achidda. It cannot be cut into pieces. Akhandi. That means it is minute perpetually, eternally. Mamaivangsa jiva bhuto jiva loke sanatana. 
Sanatana means eternally. We are small. Anu, animanam, and God, Krishna, is vibhu. God is great. Means nobody is equal to him, nobody is greater than him. That is greatness. God is great, but we say God is great, but we do not know how great he is. He is so great that millions of universes are coming from the holes of his body. Just say Ganisha Sitakala Mathavalamba Jivanti Loma Vilaja Jagadanda Natha Vishnu Mahana Sahya Jasya Kalavishesu Govinda Madhi Purisam Tamaham Bhajami. Millions of universes are coming from the breathing of Mahavishnu. So that is a little idea of the greatness of God, Krishna. Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita, Athava bahu naitena kingyatena athava arjuna. Vishtabhyam aham kṛṣṇam ekāṅśena sthito yada. This jagat, this material world, is situated on the strength of one part of me. So, this is self-realization. We must understand our position. In the Puranas also, our minute particle uh, identification, what is that? One ten thousand part of the top of the hair. Uh, we cannot see even the top of the hair. Uh, that you divide. Kesha agra. Kesha agra. Uh, the front portion of the hair. Kesha agra satabhagas. You divide into one hundred part. Satadha kulpita sacha. Again take one part and divide into one hundred part. That is the dimension of the jiva. That small particle is there within the ant, the microbic germ, and he, that part is within the elephant. Jiva Bhuta Mahava. That is the dimension. So self, self-realization, self-realization means one must know his identity. That identity, that small particle is there within me, within you. Dehi nasmin jathat dehi. Dehi is within, the deha. <clears throat> but because it is so small with our material eyes, uh, it is not possible to see. There is no such uh, instrument that you can find out. Therefore, on account of our inability to find it out, we say it is niraka. Because we cannot calculate what is the akar, what is the dimension. Uh, but the akar is there. Uh, the living entity has got full akar. If you have studied the small microbes, sometimes I see at night when I work, a small uh, <coughs> insect, just like a full stop, uh, it is walking. That means the whole uh, physiological combination and anatomy physiology is there. But you cannot see, see just like a full stop. Uh, <clears throat> so within that there is the soul. And within the elephant or big animal, uh, there is also the soul. The soul is there. Asmin dehi, dehi nasmin jatha dehi, that is there. So when we actually realize uh, what we are, uh, brahmanu bhuti, uh, <coughs> then uh, uh, our life is successful. Uh, now we are identifying with this body. So long we are identifying with this body, we are no better than the cats and dogs. Uh, whatever knowledge you may have, scientific knowledge, if you do not know yourself, then you are nothing but the animal. The animal does not know. Jashyatu buddhi kunapetri dhatuke. 
if somebody considers that this body I am self, identify, uh, I am Indian, uh, I am American, I am Brahman, I am Khatri, I am man, I am woman, I am elephant, and so on. So <coughs> this kind of identification, the Shatma Buddhi, Kunapi Tridhatuke. Kunapi means this is a bag made of kapha pitta bayu. Tridhatu. Ah. Jashatu buddhi kunapi tidhatuke sadhik kalatra disubhoma ijjadi. And thinking that in bodily relationship I'm thinking he's my own man or relative. Ah. Jashatu buddhi kunapi tidhatuke sadhik kalatra disu. Kalatra means because we have intimate relation with woman and offspring, children born of her, the kalatradishu, and bhoma is jadhi, and <coughs> the land uh, as ijja, ijja means worshipable. Nowadays it is very prominent. Uh, I heard that for land there was a fight in somewhere near. So that is going on, uh, nation to nation, uh, community to community. Uh, the Bhoma Ijjadi. They are thinking this land is mine. The land of my birth is mine. We have seen there was fight between Hindu and Muslim during partition days. This is my Pakistan, this is my Hindustan. So Bhoma Ijjadi. Just Shatu Vadhi Kunapiti Dhatuki Sadhik Kalatradhisu Bhoma Ijjadi. Jatita Buddhi Salile. Now we go to Tithastan. Uh, we go to Haridwar and Vrindavan and other nice uh, holy places, and the Christians go to Jordan, <coughs> so Jerusalem, they take bath in the Jordan. Yajati Thabuddhi Shalile. Shalile means water. Yashnatu Buddhi Kunapiti Dhatake Yajati Thabuddhi Shalile. Nakariti Janesu Abhigyesu. But have no interest to understand his identification, his spiritual identification, from the acharya, janeshu avigyeshu. Avigya means one who knows. Acharya. Tad vijyanatham sa guru meva avigacchet. This is the basic instruction. To, to understand your spiritual identity, you must find out a proper guru. Tad vijyanatham sa guru meva avigacchet. So he has no such knowledge. Acharjaman Purusha Veda. So he has no knowledge. This is superficial. So Saiva Gokhara. Such person is no better than the cows and the asses. Means animals. So this is self-realization. When one understands that I am not this body, I am minute particle of the Supreme. Krishna says, everything is said that, we have to realize it. Krishna says, Mamai Vāṅsa. Although Aṅsa, Aṅsa and Aṅsi, the whole and the part, part is never equal to the whole. That is axiomatic truth. But it is equal in quality. Just like little particle of gold is also gold. It is nothing but else. Similarly, although you are part and parcel of Krishna, very minute, infinite sima, animanam, uh, perpetually, eternally, uh, <coughs> still we are not as big as Krishna. Just like small particle of this sea water, uh, the chemically composition is the same. Uh, you will find the same test, and if you analyze, you will find all the same ingredients, chemicals, within the small particle. But the small particle is never equal to the sea, small particle of the water. <coughs> this is said, if I think, uh, because I am qualitatively one with God, therefore I have become God. That is mistake. Uh, uh, that is, Abhusuddha Buddha. They have been described in the Shastras as 
অবিশুদ্ধ আনক্লিন ইন্টেলিজেন্স আনক্লিন ইন্টেলিজেন্স জেনের বিন্দাখ বিমুক্ত মহানী দে মায়াবাদী ফিলোজ অফ দ্য থিং দ্যাট আই এম দি সেম সোহম সোহম ডাজ নট মিন দ্যাট আই এম ইকুয়াল টু গড নো বডি ক্যান বি ইকুয়াল টু গড এর গ্রেটার দেন গড দ্যাট ইজ নট গড কৃষ্ণ সেই যে ভগব মত পরতরম নান্য কিঞ্চি অস্তি ধনঞ্জয় সো নো বডি ক্যান বি গ্রেটার দেন গড আর ইকুয়াল টু গড দ্যাট ইজ দ্যাট মিন্স গ্রেটনেস অফ গড অসম ঊর্ধ্ব অসম অসম মিন্স নো বডি ইজ ইকুয়াল টু হিম অ্যান্ড নো বডি ইজ গ্রেটার দেন হিম দ্যাট ইজ গড ইফ সমবডি ক্লেমস টু বি গড দেন হি হ্যাজ টু প্রুভ that nobody is equal to him and nobody is greater than him. then he is god this is the simple definition of god that nobody equal to him and nobody greater than him. Uh, <coughs> that is krishna uh, krishna says that matta parataram nanya kinchi jasti dhananjay maiya dhananjay ajjo there is no more superior authority then me uh, and um <clears throat> in the brahma sangita it is said ishara parama krishna uh, ishara ishara means controller so we small living entities very minor still we are controller we control at least we control our family members my wife my children or if i am bigger i control my office or i control my factory i control the country i become president in this way controller controller bigger controller bigger control i go to the brahma the controller of the universe ah but he is also not supreme controller ah it is said tene brahma is meditating although he is the greatest creature living creature within this universe he is also meditating uh, to to learn controlling tene brahma rida adika bhai mai anti jasura he learned first of all how to control over the universe then he became brahma uh, of course he was born brahma but he still he has to be educated that's the we require to be educated so brahma was educated so who educated him krishna aham adirhi devanam krishna says aham adirhi devana deva the original deva is brahma vishnu mahesha so vishnu krishna is vishnu but he is the instructor of brahma and shiva this is the shastra conclusion that is greatness that is greatness so uh, we should not falsely claim that i am as great as the supreme god no we should uh, understand this animanam sayang auto jyoti am as effulgent uh, that's like spark spark is jyoti but not as a uh, brilliant if all that as the original fire the original fire part part there are some sparks uh, you have got experience the spark is also jyoti uh, if a spark falls on your cloth it will immediately burn the burning capacity is there but it is not as good as the original fire sang uh, jyoti here it is said nirantaram so nirantaram means there is so far jyoti is concerned there is no difference but the small very small anumanam uh, akhanditam this is self realization don't falsely claim that because i am qualitatively one with god therefore i am god no you may be god god means controller but you are not the supreme god the supreme god is krishna ishara parama parama means supreme uh, we are ishara maybe ishara i may be ishara for few person another may be for big nation another may be for the you can go on increasing 
but you cannot reach the uh, I mean to say position of God. Uh, that is Abhushiddha Buddha. Therefore Shastra says Jenni Rabindaka Bimukta Mani na Tai Astabhavad Abhushiddha Buddha. Uh, one who has uh, advanced very much in spiritual knowledge, uh, uh, but he is thinking himself, now I have become liberated. Uh, sometimes they claim, I have become Narayan. Uh, therefore, Mahavadis, they uh, address one another, Namo Narayan. Everyone has become Narayan. So, how everyone can become Narayan? So many Narayan? No. Narayan is what? God is what? Narayan. Uh, that was Hastha warns. Just to Narayanam Devam Brahma Rudradi Devati. Samatena Vikheta Sa Pasandi Bhavidrubam. He is Pasandi. If one compares Narayan with other demigods, uh, <coughs> now unfortunately it has come to so downtrodden position. Uh, the intelligence, that they are talking of Dharidra Narayan. What is this? This is first. Narayan is the exalted Supreme Personality of God. Uh, even Sankaracharya, he says, Narayana para abhaktyat. Narayan is beyond this universe. Uh, para abhaktyat. Abhaktyat anna sammava. And the whole universe is product of this abhakta. So we should not compare Narayan with anyone else. What to speak of Daridra? That is a foolishness. Narayan is Lakhipati, the husband, the controller of the goddess of fortune. And how he can be Daridra? This is misunderstanding. That was Shastra wants. Just to Narayana Devam, Brahma Rudradi Devati. Samatena vikheta sa pasandi bhavidruvam. If anyone thinks that Narayan or other demigods are equal to Narayan, sa pasandi, he is pasandi, atheist. So we should not think like that. You may think that you have become liberated, you have got the position of Narayan. That is all false thinking. Abhishuddha buddha. They have been addressed as abhishuddha, non-purified, buddha, intelligent, not intelligent. This jannero bindakha vimukta manina tai astabhava. This is why these things happen. One, one compares Narayan with ordinary demigod or ordinary man because abhishuddha buddha, their intelligence is not purified. So, arujya kichena parang padang tako, such person, by severe austerities and penances, may uh, elevate oneself to the position of Brahma. Still, arujya kichena parang, parang padang means Brahma pat. Arujya kichena parang padang tako, patanti adha. Again he falls down. Uh, why? Anadita jusmatangraya, because they neglected to worship your lotus feet. Uh, so unless one becomes devotee, there is no secure position in the spiritual world. Uh, one may, just like uh, a very crude example, you may have very powerful Sputnik, just like these people are trying to go to the moon planet uh, with powerful, what is it called, the machine? Uh, yes. Rocket, yes. At then, going with great force. But, uh, similarly, one can rise up to the Brahma Fallings. But if there is no shelter, just like these people are going, but they don't get any shelter. Uh, uh, but they come down again. Similarly, uh, one by severe austerities and penances may go up to the Brahma Loka. But, uh, he has no position. He has no position. Because in the Brahma Loka or Vaikuntha Loka, in the Parabhoma, the spiritual sky, there are spiritual planets. 
They are called Vaikuntha Loka. Hundreds and millions there are. Very, very big, big planets than these material planets. So unless you get a shelter in one of the planets, uh, then you again fall down. Uh, so that is because uh, we are after ananda, satchit ananda, simply to rise to the uh, platform of Brahma, that is shock, partial realization of the absolute truth, uh, shock. Then chit, uh, chit means knowledge, uh, that is also partial. Ananda, satchit ananda. When that ananda you cannot get, just like if you simply uh, in the sky you uh, fly, you don't get ananda. Therefore you have come to down, come down again to the airplane, air, airport. Uh, uh, without that there is no ananda. Similarly, simply rising up to the Brahma effulgence, there is no ananda. Uh, ananda means you have to enter into the spiritual planet where Narayan Krishna is there. Uh, <coughs> Parastasmat bhavanya bhakta bhaktya sanatana you have entered to that eternal planet. You must get some residence. Uh, the impersonalists, they do not get that. They remain, just like you remain in the sky, you cannot be happy. You want some planet. Uh, uh, but if you cannot get planet, then again you come back in this planet. So arujya krichena paranga patanga tata patanti adha. Again in this material world. Uh, therefore, we have to take to Krishna consciousness. That is real self-realization. Uh, and what is that? Very simple thing. Krishna says, Janma karma me dibbam janati tat. If you simply try to understand what is Krishna, why does He come? Uh, what is His business? Uh, what is His form? Uh, Janma karma me dibbam janati tat tat. Takta dehanga punar janma naiti mameti. Simple process. He uh, try to understand Krishna. This is Krishna consciousness moment. We are simply teaching how to understand Krishna. Uh, and if anyone is fortunate to understand, then his life is successful. Janma karma medit bhaja. So, tada purusa atmanam kivalam prakite param. Prakite param. <coughs> now we are thinking, I am the product of this material world. I am Indian. Uh, what I am Indian? Uh, because my body is Indian, I am Indian? No. I am the spirit, so Ahang Brahma. That is self realization The whole world is fighting. I am Indian, I am American, I am Pakistani, I am Hindustani, I am Hindu, I am Muslim, I am Brahmi. Dehatma uh, Buddhi. So one has to realize that I am not this body. Kevalam Pakite Param. I am beyond this world. I have a far transcendental to this material world. Uh, how it is possible? Uh, Tadala Kamalu Bhagas. We have discussed this verse yesterday. Hongamama uh, Bhimana Uthya Uthai Kamalu Bhadi. Kamalu Bhadi Malay. So long we have got the desire, lusty desire and greediness for enjoying this material world, then it is not possible. We have to free, we have to become free from these lusty desires. Uh, so this is bhakti yoga process. Uh, bhakti yoga, if we adopt the bhakti yoga process, then you become free from the kama uh, Kamalova means the influence of uh, tamagun and rajagun. Uh, so uh, as soon as we become free from, we have to become free from all the gunas, uh, because uh, chita gunai, chita khalu asya bandhai. Uh, so, uh, to become free from the gunas, uh, that is simply uh, explained in the Bhagavad Gita. Uh, you engage yourself in de devotional service, you become immediately free from the uh, influence of the gunas. Mancha bhavicharini bhakti yogena. Jasevat. 
Anyone who is engaged in rendering service to the Lord, uh, bhakti yoga, bhakti yoga according to the because we are not uh, expert in approaching the supreme Lord, therefore we have to follow. Uh, the principles of bhakti yoga as enunciated by the acharya, uh, sadhu shastra, uh, by the order of spiritual master, by the order of the shastras, you have to execute this function of bhakti yoga. And as soon as you become attached to it, you become practiced to it, immediately you become self-realized. Thank you very much. Thank you.